Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and today we're going to talk about Google Stadia. So far this week Google has announced three upcoming pro games for May and has published its fortnightly this week on Stadia blog with some new game trials, a new expansion, free play days and a new game set to be coming soon. So to start with, Google has published their latest this week on Stadia blog announcing a bunch of new game trials without the need to create a Stadia account bringing the total number of games you can play on trial without an account up to 13. And this also includes World War Z Aftermath, which you can play for up to 60 minutes, and Yeast 9 Monstrum Knox, you can play for up to two hours. So the new titles added to the trial lineup are Pac-Man Mega Tunnel Battle. You can play this classic title with a Battle Royale twist for up to 30 minutes, or if you have a Stadia account, you can buy this game for $16.99. And next we have Blaze and the Master Machines, Axel City Racers. This game is from Outright Games and is based on the children's TV program. And you can play this game for up to an hour or you can buy this in the Stadia store for $34.99. You also have Dragon Quest Echoes of an Elusive Age. This action RPG is available to play for up to two hours and can be purchased in the Stadia store for $34.99. And finally we have Little Nightmares Complete Edition. This adventure platformer that will make you face your childhood fears is available to play for 30 minutes and can be purchased in the Stadia store for $23.99. All the prices mentioned are in British pounds. To find out how much they are in your region, head over to the Stadia store to find out more. And for Stadia Pro subscribers, you can claim Dark Side Detective, a Fumble in the Dark expansion, or it can be purchased in the Stadia store for £12.99. It's nice to see more developers support Stadia and add more game trials to the platform as this can help people decide if cloud gaming is for them or not without having to create an account or part with any money and use the devices and controllers they already own. So today Google had announced the first three pro games to be added in May and with more games to be announced later down the line and I can see this being another good month for Stadia Pro as we are getting Outriders. Now this game I have not played yet but when I do see videos on this game, it does give me the Division vibes. So I can't wait to play this game when it comes out on May 1st. Now the last two games announced was Paw Patrol the Movie Adventure City Calls and Lumote, which is a 3D puzzle platformer with vivid visuals. We were shown this game a little while back and I'm not one for puzzle games, but I am definitely looking forward to checking this one out. So last up for the video today, Google has announced that Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach will be coming soon to Stadia. This is a family friendly horror survival game which was released on console and PC in December 21. There was no date given as to when it will be coming to the platform but Google did say it will be coming soon but I'm not getting my hopes up for this being part of Maze Pro lineup although that would be a great addition to Maze Pro lineup. Now whilst recording this video Google did announce another game called Death Run TV. This is a twin stick shooter set in the world's craziest game show. Now I'm personally looking forward to this one as the videos that I have seen this game looks incredibly crazy and I really can't wait to check it out when it is released. And that's it for today's video guys. Please smash that like button if you enjoyed this video and hit subscribe if you would like to see more content in the future. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.